that shit, I'm going to hell. I mean, I can, I can walk fast and far farther than I can swim. <laughs> Brother, you get on the ship and say you get torpedoed out right there, you got to swim a long fucking way. <laughs> so I never, I mean, but then them boys come back and they're from experience in the Navy and they come, some got to be divers in the Navy. And they come back, they brought, you know, scuba diving and stuff like that and they started doing that, cutting cutting the expenses down on, on the boats going out, you know what I mean? And they started doing that, they eliminated the hard head. You know, the helmet that sure. they use. Have you been on that exhibition boat? Yes, there? I have. Yeah, go up, you know, that diving. And sure. The, they don't do that no more. That's uh, a few years after the war, they limited the helmet, and then they eliminated the suit and the, the most shoes that they uh, armed shoes. And they started bringing out the scuba divers, you know, with the mask. Yeah. You just use a mask and a bathing suit from 25 feet, five fathoms, six fathoms, six a fathom is six foot, right? Yep. And they worked in the shallow water. There was more sponge there, you know. It was a good quality of sponge. Because the deeper you go, the better sponge it is because the tide is stronger. And Mother Nature makes a strong the sponge in the deeper water, stronger sponge, better looking sponge. You know, because uh -huh. you gotta survive in the in the, in the stronger water. Have you ever been down in one of those suits with a hard hat? No, no, oh yeah, oh yeah. Before everybody, we had. When you were a kid, huh? When my brother and I made a got a five gallon coffee. I mean, all they send grease, so grease is in them, them uh, five gallon with olive oil here. My brother and I, my brother, two older brothers, kind of engineer, they hooked up. Uh, the thing and they would put it in the boat and we had one of the hand pumps, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and we had the hose going down there. And so all right, you know, in the shallow we was out here, I had to go, you know, <laughs> 10 feet of water and stuff. And we had a boat, we had built a boat in our manual training school, you know, school here, and built a 16 foot boat. And our brothers and I would, would go out there and talk to the anchor key there before you would even develop or even. Have you always lived in Tarpon Springs? Oh yeah, I was born right over them trees right down there. Oh, is that right? My whole family, my four brothers. Have you ever traveled much? Not till they long, Uncle Sam come and got me. So, uh, I graduated school on uh, June the 6th and June the 13th, they had me in the Army. You were drafted? Right. My two older brothers now, they volunteered in the Air Force. When I got ready to go in this army season, no, you, you got to wait your turn to get back. So what uh, what year was that? 1943. I graduated high school in 1943. I was born in 1943. Yeah.